click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, I welcome you all to this video. We are with the second video for the chapter number 13 microwave measurements. So previously we have address for the microwave measurements. What is the difference with respect to the low frequency signal measurements and at the microwave frequency measurements here. So in this particular lecture, we are being introduced to the very important component from the microwave test bench, which is called as slotted line. Hence the topic introduction to slotted line. So here we start with our topic, the topic titled introduction to slotted line. As the name of this particular microwave component or microwave device, I can say the name is slotted line. So the second term at the end is giving us information that it is nothing but a transmission line. So the various kind of transmission lines we have gone through, we have the two conductor transmission line, the multi-conductor transmission line, the single conductor transmission line, the popular ones for the microwave test bench and the microwave engineering applications are the waveguides here. So we can have either the rectangular cross section, so rectangular waveguide or circular waveguide. Working on to the semiconductor platform, we also have the choice to work with the micro strip lines. So now the slotted line is basically a transmission line and most possibly in the microwave test bench, you will come to have it to be the rectangular waveguide and that has been slotted here. So what is the purpose to have a slot insertion? for the rectangular waveguide the purpose is to make the measurements here so basically the slotted line is mounted with a coupling probe so basically the rectangular waveguide if you like to have it is a hollow metallic tube having rectangular cross section so let us see this is port 1 and this is port Two, and there it will be the propagation of microwave signal in general from port 1 to port 2 here. So while we have propagation inside the device at some locations there it will be the different levels of the strengths corresponding to the E and H vectors. So there sometimes you can come across the Vmax there sometimes you can come across the minimas there. So the coupling probe that has been mounted over the slotted such a transmission line will be moving along the entire length L of the waveguide and the use of this coupling probe is to have the detection of in general the standing wave pattern or finally the measurement of standing wave ratio that we generally represent by rho or VSWR we can say here. So let us visualize how exactly the slotted line look like. So this is the simple schematic of the very popular component in the microwave test bench called as slotted line. So you can see here right from this opening to this opening onto the back side here you can see. So this is the rectangular waveguide. The length of the rectangular waveguide you can physically also make the measurement here or whatever this assembly it is there to which a provision to connect here the tunable detector which is our next topic to address for or a coupling probe in general we can say we can have the mounting and with the help of this particular knob we can have the position of this mounted coupling probe changed from one end to another end throughout the entire length of the rectangular waveguide here. So now to measure the position we have the scale markings at different values throughout this linear dimension here. Now at the center to the top wall there it is a single insertion made 
through that insertion we can have the coupling probe inserted up to certain depth inside the hollow cavity of the rectangular waveguide so this is all about the slotted line here so by the next lecture we shall continue with the same chapter addressing the topic introduction to tunable detector so i hope you are enjoying learning with the various topics for microwave engineering subject for more such information and the details if you like to have you can subscribe to ekda channel thank you